Welcome in once again to the YGO Fresh Off The Press community, where we analyze the current posts, trends, and forecast of the Yu-Gi-Oh! markets. We're here to feed the endless eternal Yu-Gi-Oh! cardboard market watch addiction, guys. You guys already know. Welcome in just a hair away from 3.8K, man. Man, it's a good time to be alive and in Yu-Gi-Oh! Beautiful. The channel continues to grow. I can smell 4K just around the corner, man. These Ks have been going down one by one. 1K, boom, two, three, four, then five guys. We're on our way to four. Four 10 Billy TCG player gift cards to four winners. Make sure you destroy the like and subscribe button. Boom, right there. Ring that bell so that you guys can take advantage of our giveaways, guys. Channel giveaways, man. Who doesn't like free, free TCG player gift cards? Come on now, man. One click. Get to you when it can't get any better than that. Immediately, let's get to the markets. Gore's the emissary of darkness from the gold series Haunted Mine. Beautiful, fresh off the oh, man, fresh off the press card. Yo, I have a copy. Where's my, my Edison deck? Is around there, guy. I have my I have my beautiful copy of this card. You can't make this up, man. Just look at this chart. Going parabolic. This card was twenty billies for years and years, over a decade ago. Just twenty billies. No one cared about this gold for Oh, it's a gold series haunted in mind. Ghost ring, no one cares about it. Yada, yada, yada. We have secrets. They look better. There's that and the other. Guys, this is Max Rarity. Max Rarity Gores. Edison hype is here. You know, personally, I've been playing a lot of Edison lately. Um, And I've been having a blast. I really don't miss modern Yu-Gi-Oh. I, I love covering modern Yu-Gi-Oh. You know, staying up to date with the core sets, with the reprints, and every all the work I put into my channel. I love it. But at the same time, on a personal level, I've just been playing Edison and go here and there and i i'm i'm a yugi boomer you know i love retro yugi and i've been having a blast and you can clearly see that a lot of people have been deciding to do the same look at this chart just going parabolic last price was 26s last time we covered this card it was around that price and boom cleaned out by mr clean he came in jay i'm here i'm here to do my job boom 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 cleaned out the markets three listings here one page only and that's it gone look at this beautiful card man man yo if i would have known this card i would feel bad honestly because gores is at one in edison and i play life swords and it looks beautiful i won't lie my, my ghost rear looks just amazing but of course you do have other printings you know secret rares from dark legends from retro pack you have commons and we're getting a new common in the player starter set i think as well you have ultras these are the clean you know uh, a manga promo ultra and uh yeah 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 yeah. like these two secrets i own multiples of these and of these as well so i mean yeah, you're gorgeous, man. If you ever plan on playing um, Edison, which is, it's great. It's amazing, in my humble opinion. Um, make sure you don't miss out. The hype is here, man. People coming in, just cleaning this card out. Man, man, oh man. Getting bought out, man, as you guys can see. Reborn Tengu. I would suppose there's a Tengu plant format, right? If I'm not mistaken. Um, actually, you know, getting support by Konami and Team YCS Vegas or whatever, I think, if I'm not mistaken. So I guess Tengu um, format is because of this card. I don't know. I've never played Tengu format. You know, um, uh, you guys probably know more than me. It was a single digi Ultra Max rarity. And uh, yeah, this card used to be fives, went up to 15, 16s, 3x, retrace hard back down to the mean into the single digis and now respiking back up. Honestly, based on this chart, the trend is your friend until the end. We made a higher low up here. And now we're going to go to 15s to 16s, as we can clearly see here, and attempt to breach that towards 20s. Guys, seven listings only, single digit listings here. And uh, yeah, this card is going to 20s and then cleaned out. One page only. Look at all these buyouts, man. Insane what's going on with the markets right now. This is a max rarity of Reborn Tangle, I would believe so. And uh, yeah, you're going to have to pay that premium if you want access to it. Look, guys, Speedroid. Tech and Tomboy. We've been talking about this card endlessly on the channel. We told you guys it's too easy. Why? Because rank threes are coming. Goblin bikers are coming, and they might probably use this engine, the Speedroid engine. Now that Terra Top is to two, back to two off the list. And look, we talked about this card at a Billy, went up to 336s, then came back down. A little bit of a retracement. Boom. Second leg up status, just continuing on up. And uh, yeah, look at that. Seven listings as well. You have one here, a couple of deals, then gone. One page only. 
people coming in man i'm glad i have my copy yes you have commons you have other rarities we get it okay but if you want the super rare um the max rarity i believe so for this card you're gonna have to pay up in high speed riders this thing came up like seven eight years who knows many many years ago man um so uh yeah we've been talking about this card hopefully you guys listen and we said guys goblin bikers around the corner make sure you have access to this card we could have clearly done a fresh off the flashback off this one um because we talked about it. it was twos maybe threes and now yeah you have one here but essentially it's doubled up and only a couple of one ofs then it's gone guys so hopefully y'all listen look at this chart man this chart is not playing games man men lie women lie the charts don't lie we analyzed the first spike we said even before that you know we were analyzing the card we're like guys get this holographic version don't miss out then speed roid terror top as well once the ban list came got off you know um to two we were actually talking about this card before the list i had forgotten that this card was still at one the first time i talked about it down here your boy picked up like six of these i already sold three i still have my playset. um beautiful went from under billy to five giving like a six or seven x now retracing back down this is the time this is the time when it's retracing down everyone forgot about this card no one's paying attention talking tomboy already started this is next you don't want to be paying a premium you don't want to be paying 2x from these current pri current prices like 27 listings you don't want to be that guy a lot of one ups you don't want to come in and pay 10 dollars and above because you decide one day to play goblin bikers you know and and miss out on this 2x right here don't be that guy you come in early i mean this is technically a little late since we were talking about it down here but again better to come in now after the retrace went back down to the mean before that second leg of status just like taka tomboy is on right now we have lifeless leaf fish man wow so this one yo look at that artwork man i like it. i like it man i hadn't stopped to see to you know to see the the artwork on this card and honestly i like it man 10 listings only man what's going on with it? Ooh, beautiful chart man Look at it, this chart, man. Higher highs, higher lows. The trend is your friend until the end. Going parabolic right now. Literally, in this parabolic advance cycle. This card was what? Two billies of that? Boom. Spiking it, giving that 3x already. A lot of one ofs. And eventually, mm, 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 Towards nines with the wallet chain after that double digits. One page only. If you need a lifeless fish, man. <laughs> if you don't want to live to fight another day, come in and get this this lifeless fish man, from rise of the duelist yeah you do have a common who cares man i mean you know hey take that back maybe this common could be a good investment man you come in at quarters you know maybe there's a billy down the line I like it i like it as a penny stock man if you need this lifeless fish man make sure you swing by and pick it up sooner rather than later guys edison hype is here as well heavy storm a card used in goat and in edison and a lot of people actually are speculating that by the next ban list this card probably should be off it and i can't blame them guys so look you want to come in man this card is in an uptrend continues to go up that's not bad these deals under fives because then eventually becomes eight and then double digits two pages only 13 listings yeah there's a, a joey's world one ultra rare as well but both versions are max rarity of heavy storm now honestly i wouldn't lie i would clearly and definitely take a secret rare reprint down the line maybe in a speed dual set or you know um uh, the 25th rarity you know we get a the, the rarity collection too i would love a secret rare heavy storm but for now ultra is the max rarity me i have um an ultra rare in my gold deck and i have a super rare um in my life sworn edison deck so i just ordered another copy of these of this to max rarity bump it in uh, my life sworn deck and then i'm building black wings as well in edison so yeah, you can never have too many copies of heavy storm it's broken you know and used in those formats and uh, who knows maybe even in modern Yu-Gi-Oh, it comes at least back to one if it does this card is going to be minimum double digits and maybe even spike into oblivion unless it gets another reprint then we have guardian slime guys guys money is energy it is transferred guys it doesn't disappear it's transferred simply from one end to the other the money was stored the energy you know what's stored in ancient chant where's that card right here right here where is it where is it boom ancient chant where is it the ultra rare look look where is it boom right here let's go to the og the og came out and what's that legendary duelist look right here legendary duelist rage of raw Le legendary duelist rage of raw this got a reprint i don't know why this didn't get a reprint Come on. so what do you think is going to happen this thing is going to be 
first in the teens then a single digit card hopefully you guys sold when we told you but look this was a 50 bill card so all that money is being trapped people selling up here they're gonna transfer it over to the next best thing out of this set which yes there's a ghost rare this got reprinted but you know this is spiking up and then this is spiking up you know maybe these um ultras here might be good investments man because the energy is transferring over you know that monetary energy look at that look at that if this thing wants to refresh right here man look pushing threes and then fours for blaze cannon look all these god cards you want to come in now no one's paying look at this one guardian slime parabolic all-time high in price look 18 billies 10 listings only pushing 20s and beyond one page only this card that's crazy i had a play set of this that i bought around like five dollars and then i sold that around like tens or something like that so i mean you know we take the two ways but sometimes you know <laughs> it hurts to see it man you know what i mean but that was a while back and uh yeah i mean as you can see people coming in that monetary value is just transferring from one hand to another man people selling this people other people buying you know and it's that buy and sell game and this one i expect it to continue going up until it gets a reprint and it's in need of a reprint already same with millennium revelation from the same set look this is a super rare this thing was a billy 50 boom agent chant gets a reprint and now this is pushing you have a couple of deals here but really it's pushing fives man four pages only 32 listings and um yeah like we just covered from this set man a lot of hidden value people forgot about this set extremely hard to get these cards and the holographics you know related to ancient chant now that this gets a reprint you know and this got a reprint and then uh now uh where is it and uh, well not this but yeah ancient chat and th these two got a reprint so now these are going up until those get reprints as well then we have the phantom knights of torn scale secret rare from phantom rage we see used to be six dollars last time we covered it and boom continues on up and it's parabolic advance here towards double digits eventually if we clean this up janitor style we do see actually a couple of listings a couple of deals but after that it pushes double digits towards the bottom of the page three pages only 24 listings it's a phantom knight card man a lot of people really like phantom knights and you never know a lot of people have expectations maybe heading into the new meta where not many people are looking this deck to compete this deck archetype and who knows man it might come in out of nowhere and surprise the masses then we have sage with eyes of blue man this blue eyes card it continues going up this needs another reprint in battles of legend chapter one come on now konami just give it to us please look at that you have a couple there at under um in the single digi range after that pushing 14s two pages 19 listings only yet yeah, does it have another secret and things of that nature but all versions have been going up because people playing blue eyes you know they, they want their sages man and the card looks beautiful i won't lie beautiful artwork like if you just take a moment to see this card excuse me you, you you'd understand why the card is appreciating in price then we have red eyes dark dragoon man i forgot to look up the fresh off the flashback man for this one we told you guys this card was pushing 30s we said it we were talking about the prismatic secret we came in we analyzed this chart we said resistance was 25s and if it pierced that it was going to be 30 billies before you guys know it we were talking about the prismatic but for this one as well i mean it's, it's too easy man it's too man you, you can't you can't make this stuff up man honestly little bit of a retracement here for this one but look 24 25s after these walls get gobbled up we expect 30s for just like the og version i mean the demand this card still doesn't have a reprint it is a broken card and uh yeah yeah we need this man imagine 25th anniversary you know rarity uh, collection too you imagine man pur this card i don't really like purs pcrs man that'd be nice psrs Ooh man mm -mm -mm. come on now konami do us right man give us this in the rarity collection too so me you know what i'd be doing i wouldn't be holding to the starlight man that's just me that's just your boy you know i take advantage of this respike to 200s 200s maybe 250s be like let me unload this man because uh you never know man this is the year of the reprints reprint season is here the first half of this year and you don't want to get caught holding this bag you know um uh, especially the starlights you know but me me if i don't discard mm, i'd be selling man maybe 30s 35s max i would be dumping this but that's just me because i smell a reprint i just have a hunch that reprint hunch that your boy jay has is a matter of time before this card gets its fourth reprint sooner rather than later now we have levere the sea dragon ultimate rare from generation force look at this card wow just spiking up into oblivion 
parabolic just like the channel mm, mm, mm. essentially triple digits for this ultimate rare insanity craziness in these markets mm. and look even the unlims are fitties man there's just a couple before after that part is just triple digits this is what this is a literal buyout man five listings only people coming in uh yeah 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 i mean hey the meta changes all the time the meta shifts that's where the money comes to the demand um low supply max rarity and uh yeah yeah this card got cleaned out now safira queen of dragons a lot of you guys in the comments last time we talked about this you guys like jay but you know they don't um voiceless voice i think doesn't even use this or i don't know why it's going up and this and that it's ritual support man once rituals get support i mean everything entailed with that you know um mechanic usually tends to spike up you have one for 25s then 35s and then 40s and then 50s and then gone one page only five listings first at Safira queen of dragons ultimate rare cleaned out by mr clean this is mr clean's marker watch man he's coming in and putting that work guys take advantage of what now man link in the description down below you come over here this big fat link man we're lazy but just a couple of clicks you get access to 15 dollars you know off for, for example a card like this transaction rollback anything that you need you can come over here and whatnot man and i thank you man uh you know a couple of you guys have been going in and uh, remember if you follow make sure you actually take advantage of your credit um as it does help me and the channel a lot i'm transparent integrity at its finest you know and i i like to provide that 15 dollar code for you guys because i would want that man from a market watcher that i'd be watching that'd be fire so make sure you guys take advantage of that short form content platforms the discord on our way to 350 people don't forget to swing by don't miss out large community in there um and then we have the podcast as well for the new people here and don't forget to check out the friends of the channel these guys are amazing destroy the like and subscribe button so that you can participate in our channel giveaways for 10 billy tcg player gift cards coming your way at 4k um and uh, so you can stay informed and none of this content is official financial advice it's for entertainment purposes only now shout out to cody because every time i talk about number 76 by the way cody's a member of the channel thank you so much um you know and and shout out yeah where is it man where is this thing? i need to show this um let me, let me just find this man where is it where is it just give me a second here so many tabs open here 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 it is man look at this look at this. i need to show this right now man talking about cody and then i just had to switch over to francisco man over there in the discord again shout out to cisco man look at that Look at that, just received my Typhoon and Mystery giveaway. My guy, he's a member of the channel as well. Always support it, you know, via the comment section. Look, we always, yo, where's the stack, man? I'm telling y'all, man, look at that. We, we, look, the stack is smaller. Why? Because we put our money where our, where our mouth is, man. We, we, we said we giving away these sky crises. Look at that. There's the evidence right there. Look at that. Look at that beautiful picture. Mm, mm, mm. How do you think Cisco felt when he received that in his mailbox, man? fresh off the press just like the channel so francisco's my guy shout out to francisco a member of the channel man i really appreciate it thank you for posting it on here always commenting my videos and showing that support um and i appreciate my members and that's it that's why you want to swing by the discord man you always be doing giveaways in there and then that's why you want to make sure you subscribe so you can participate in giveaways there it is man there's the evidence we don't play around here oh jay but maybe you do giveaways and you don't send the cards and nah we don't do we don't play that game look at that man cisco look at this look at that. look at it drewster booster shout out to him giveaway came in the mail today looking fresh off the let's go man my guy drew i appreciate that you know what i mean shout out to jimmy too another member of the channel man just members left and right i appreciate it um so thank you so much just wanted to make sure i highlighted that and then talking off that cody every time i talk about number 76 Cody always comments, man, every single video. But he he mentions this. He says, man, great call and things of like that. And we talked about this card down here. Two, three dollars. You know what I said? This card respikes, I'd be selling. Why? Because it comes in Battles of Legend Heroes Revenge and Battles of Legend Chapter 1. The reprint set is coming just around the corner. So again, we find ourselves in the same position. Number 76, Harmonizer Gr Gradiel. I have no clue who uses this or for what i won't lie but what i have a clue is reading charts guys and this chart you know what it's telling me man it's telling me it's going parabolic just like the channel in its parabolic advance cycle the final stage of the move i don't see this card getting two legs up second leg up status and things of that nature why because the growth has been too much if you go to the yearly chart look at it all-time high entering price discovery this card was a billion some change 
That's shit, look at that. That's a 10x, man. It's a 10x. Like, what do you see 10x's, man? Only like in crypto, man. It's hard to get 10x's in life. You know what I mean? Excuse me, guys. So me, I'd be dumping this, man. I was dumping this in the last time we were talking about this. Now I would dump it even more because there's an ROH here. And then eventually it does push us 20, one page, 20s, one page only single digi listings, man. I believe this card is a stretch though. I mean, if Battles of Legend chapter one comes out and this is not in there, then I'd come in and I'd pay a premium. I'd be that guy under those circumstances, but I wouldn't risk it for the biscuit. Honestly, I think this card is getting a reprint soon. That's just my hunch. You guys play it what it is, or, you know, take that information and play it how you guys believe best. Now we have Tomb Kingdom. I know it's your rare from Jag Dragons of Legend. Are the complete series? What was series? What is this? 13 billies of 20s? How? What is going on here? Six single digit listings? 29.30. What in the world is going on? But we have an ulti, man. The ulti was like 20 bills the other day. Look at the secret rares. It's cheaper than the. What the? What is going on? Nah, y'all gotta chill, man. How much is this ulti, man? Stop playing. Look at that. Ultimate Rare Toon Kingdom is $24. Ulti. Clean cut, fresh off the press. Max Rare. Well, we have Pharaoh's Rare and stuff. For me, this is still Max Rare, but oh well. And you have this Ultra Rare exceeding those prices. Man, look at this. Gamer's Choice has 90. Mm, mm, mm. What a wall of China. But it's going parabolic, getting cleaned out. You do have the wall. But look, only six listings, guys. So honestly, I just wanted to inform you guys if you had this card. I'd be dumping this to the market. That's just me. I would prefer to sell this and get the OT, guys. I won't lie. That's just me. You do with that as you please. Then we have Raid Raptor, Stranglelanius. Remember, we're getting more Raid Raptor support soon. And um, Phantom Rage, not as easy to get. This card was $2. Boom, spiking up, giving you that 3x with some sales, even at six billies a pop. You do see a little bit of a retracement, 19 listings, massive wall of China. That's um, almost at five billies. So, card is up to 2.5x already. And uh, yeah, look at that, 14 listings, man. Not easy, not easy, two pages. Mm. After this wall uh, gets gobbled up, it'll be sevens and eventually double digits for a super rare from Phantom Rage. Then we have Elemental Hero, The Shining. This one, it continues to spike up in price, a hero card. And uh, yes, pushing 20s, man. Pushing, then eventually 25s at the bottom of the page, two pages, only 12 listings. Extremely hard card to get, as you can see here. It's a manga promotional card, ultra rare. So uh, it'll have that extra value and uh, just hard to get, man. So uh, yeah, this one's spiking up in price. We have closed forest. Look at that beautiful card. Look at that eye in the background. Love it. I own like one of these, but what does this feel smell good for? Why is this thing used to be a couple of dollars, Billy's gone. I need to list mine, man. I know I got one. I don't know if I got multiples. Why? Cause for your boy Jay before making his channel back in the day years ago, I'm like, I like, you know, buying random miscellaneous stuff. I went into Yu-Gi-Oh! video game promotional cards and I saw this card. I'm like, ultra rare, you know, from a, a promo a video game promo, you know, hard to get. Count me in. So I think I bought, I know I bought one. I should have shown it like this. I have it. I, I know I have one, uh, maybe multiples. You know, I don't think more than two, but um, yeah, you know, you're actually getting sales, guys. Can you guys leave a comment section in the comment? Leave a comment in the comment section down below. Let me know what's going on with this card because... Is this a single print too? No way. That's crazy. Single print? Let me see. Okay, it's not. It's not. Um, but it's the one that the max rarity. Look at that. Cleaned out, man. Bought out. All right now, Magical Android is another one, guys, that due to the Edison hype is an extra deck staple in Edison. Me, I have the max rarity. Why? Because I bought this thing when it was like four or five dollars like years ago. When no one was, you know, um, when the Edison hype was in here. This is the version that I have. Used to be 24s, 25s. I was retracing back down to 20s, 21s. But yeah, I mean, they're all pushing into the high teens, guys, for this card. Only four versions. This one needs a reprint. I own the Ultra. I wouldn't mind getting, you know, a, a secret rare or, you know, uh, just more reprints of this card. Even though I would lose value, you know, if I wouldn't have this card, I would, and if I would be from the outside looking in, I wouldn't want to pay this premium, man. Look at that. For a rare 17 bills for a DT. Nah, man. But. I mean, it's needed in Edison, man. So I'm glad I got my, I got mine. You know, same for Thought Ruler, Archfiend. I got the Secret Rare, but the DT continues moving on up. We clean this up here real quick. We do see 14 bills here, pushing 20s at the bottom of the page. 
you do have other versions especially the brothers of legend ultra at you know readily available at quarters but don't take this for granted and i see this ultra being at least a billy down the line if it doesn't get another reprint just due to the edison hype alone this is the version i own every time i cover this card i can't believe that this card is still what like five dollars there's no way man look at it look at it. it's moving on up though quickly one page only only 10 listings getting bought out as well why because this secret rear looks ooh, fire man i own this for my edison extra deck and i'm not i don't plan on selling that that thing looks really really nice and then for my second and third decks i'll just have the ultra rares but uh yeah don't miss out on this one guys diviner of the herald guys this card is going parabolic literally literally we called it we talked about this one when it was uh in the teens we said guys if you need to play this ritual support is coming man i generally i forgot to do um because i was preparing many different videos i forgot to do the fresh off the flashback of us talking about this card but the ogs the people that watch daily know we talked about this card 17s we said guys it's gonna be 20s then 25s honestly i didn't think it would push 40s 40s right now nah 17 that listings that's a lot man it's crazy what's going on with the markets man look at that just parabolic beautiful chart man mm -mm -mm. so if you need this man hopefully you guys listen again this is the ogs at 40s and then you have the prismatics you know pushing 25s and eventually 30s and uh yeah me me aunt me if i'm not playing voiceless voice this is the time to consider dumping you sell into the hype you don't sell down here no one cares about the card you sell up here you know i won't lie excuse me i sold up here already you know into the first wave why because i bought down here i'll take my 2x i lit to fight another day but if you still own this card this is it man jay but voiceless voice is coming why would i sell? you sell into the hype the hype before the once the product is here everyone that wants the card already has it you know what i mean so make sure that you sell into the hype that's just what i'd be doing but again this is no official financial advice now soul release man someone played this against me in edison um uh like two nights whenever i went to the tournament and um it destroyed me because i play lights i won't lie so like up to five cards from the graveyard banished them that's simple just too good man too good I got destroyed in Edison, man. Eight Billies, first Eds, pushing double digits, and uh, yeah, all copies of Soul Release are moving on up. Honestly, even look, common from a Speed Duels, a set three dollars. All these, man, they're all moving on up because it's a broken card. Especially, um, look at that. That's crazy. Used to be under a Billy, no more. I mean, look, people buying these at fives. The hype is here, man. Um. And I'm telling you guys, the Edison takeover is here. And I'm not saying that you can't use this card even in modern Yu-Gi-Oh! But uh, yeah, yeah, the proof is in the pudding, guys. Then we have Ground Zeno as well. Look at this card. It used to be 25s. What in the world is going? What is going on with these markets, man? I, I left the best for last. Like, look at this chart. It's like... Yo, if you didn't sell this before and you're watching this, man... Is either two things is either gonna top out around 45 to 50s or it's gonna get a reprint so i saw my ground zenos at around 30s a long time ago um but if i still had this card this is it man this is as clear of a sell signal as you guys are ever going to receive dinos they're not really doing much in the meta um yes the meta is gonna shift and change as the core sets come out but i don't see dinos taking over so yeah shout out to sage and the peeps in the discord they said maybe it was due to master duel or something like that i don't play master duel so i'm not sure um but whatever the reason if you own this card and you're not using it please recycle that purchasing power and make sure you live to fight another day let's get it guys hopefully you guys had a blast in today's video as always the channel continues to grow and that's all thanks to you guys if you made it out this far into the video you guys are the straight mvps guys don't forget don't forget to subscribe to the channel one click man one click if you're watching like this just put a vertical and subscribe just double check man um i really appreciate it and if you're new here welcome into the channel um you know this is how we do it at the fresh off the press community we're just trying to grow i'm on our way to 3.8k and eventually four then the target is going to clearly be five um and then after that just work our way towards 10k because we always have to have goals you know um and just things that that we work for and that's why i put in the grind man. every single day um no excuses um again not to say that maybe one day an emergency or whatever no one's perfect right but 
I, I give my best. I try my best. Hopefully, you guys appreciate. I know my members do. And by the way, if you want to become a member, boom, one click gets you in. Um, just a couple of shekels a month, and you get access to members' videos. Um, and also members' Discord and things of that nature. I need to do a members' video, man. I'm slacking. I'm slacking. But I've been sick the past couple of weeks. But it's, it's right about that time, you know, to give the members a video. So make sure you guys check that out. Guys, man, thank you so much for your time, for your support, and for your attention. Stay fresh.